Hi guys! I just really wanted to do a quick video on my morning routine and my battery doesn't have a lot of charge so I'm going to do it really 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 fast it's just going to be a rundown. First I floss and then I do oil pulling. If you don't know what oil pulling is, there's tons of videos on the internet about it. It's actually really, really healthy for your mouth and just like your overall body because there's a lot of bacteria in your mouth, especially if you're one of those people that eat first and then brush your teeth. Um, you don't necessarily have to use coconut oil, I just really like the taste of coconut oil. You could use olive oil if that's your jam. Just remember to put the spoonful in your mouth and then swish it around and do not eat the oil that you've been swishing around in your mouth because it has all the yucky bacteria that's in your mouth and all the germs that's really, really bad for you. Any uh, sickness or health conditions, it actually helps those conditions because it's helping your internal organs and your overall health of your body. And I actually do this in the morning and in the evening. After my mouth has been cleaned, I use a little bit of water and rinse out the residue. And then I go ahead and I go even a step further to detox my body and I drink detox tea. Um, this one is just from Trader Joe's or World Market. It's not like, I don't know, it's, it's not one of those ones that I've seen around YouTube that I actually really want to try. And then after I've had my detox tea, I sit there and I go and I take vitamins. Well, this one's more of a weight loss supplement. Um, you don't necessarily, if you have anxiety, um, be very, very careful with things like this because it can actually make your anxiety worse. I usually just, to be honest, I only take one of these. I don't sit there and go for um, like the three times a meal type thing because I actually do have anxiety. I take a vitamin and I take a women's um, supplemental vitamin just because um, I also have um, mild depression and um, I noticed when I was sick and I was taking emergency for an entire week I became ridiculously happy and I realized I probably have a vitamin deficiency and that's probably one of the reasons why I might suffer from depression occasionally. And I just use clean and clear because this has um, the citrus in it it's and the vitamin C, it wakes me up. And then if I'm having like any breakouts, like right now I have a little bit of a breakout, but whatevs, I'll follow that up with a mask if I have the time, and today is Saturday. Then I like to exfoliate my lips because if I'm going to wear makeup, that's what I like to do and I kind of feel like wearing makeup today. To hydrate my face because it is currently winter time, and the one that works really well for my under eye area is the Olay, what is it? Olay Age Defying Eye Gel, and it's just like this clear one. Um, this one works really well for my skin. I find that my skin really responds to gel um, for my under eye and just generally on my face. This is another gel moisturizer and this one is for all over my face and it is winter time so I'm using the Neutrogena Hydro Boost Water Gel Moisturizer and I do that after I put the gel on my eyes and I let that sit for about two to three minutes so it can soak up into my skin and then I use the Derma E Anti-Wrinkle Vitamin A Retinol Cream um, I use this because I'm actually 27 and I'm going on 28 and I've um, 
been noticing my friends and uh, you know just like people that are generally like around my age they tend to form more wrinkles and like age spots and things like that even I've been using it even before then because I want it to have great skin um, not everybody has to follow that step if you're younger um, I, I started doing this like when I was like around 21 um, but not everyone has to do that and then I go and I put on sunblock. Um, I put on sunblock even in winter. It's just because of my skin tone. I have, if you can tell, an olive complexion. And it's pretty dark right now because I went to Maui so I got tan. Um, but generally speaking, my skin is prone to sun damage and you could probably tell there's a little bit of sun damage on my face because when I was younger I did not put on sunblock because nobody told me. So if you're younger, this is the one step that I would just do. It doesn't matter how old you are, go put on some sunblock on your face. And I like the Neutrogena Clear Face. Um, this is the breakout free liquid lotion sunscreen. This one has SPF 55. Generally speaking, the higher the SPF, the better for your face, and especially if it says broad spectrum. Now, um, this one is very liquidy. I like that. It's also very, very um, not greasy on my face, depending on what your needs are. And if you like organic, sunscreen there's plenty of alternatives you do not have to use this one um this is just the one that works out best for me now i hope you guys have a wonderful and great day and i know that's a lot of stuff that i just kind of threw at you but literally this is what i do almost every single morning hope you guys have a wonderful day and thank you so much for watching bye